What's up everybody, it's your boy True, back at it again with another video. Uh, again, Happy New Year's. Uh, hopefully your year is starting off great. You got big plans and are going to make things happen. Uh, today I will be showing the shoes I picked up kind of at the end of the year. I haven't bought anything as of yet, as of this video for 2022. Um, we got a few things on my list, but uh, trying to uh, take care of some other things first. I know we all say that in sneakerheads, but that never really happens that way. But we'll see, man. <laughs> Jump straight into it. First and foremost, of course, you know, uh, Cool Gray Jordan 11s. Um, these are the new ones. I do have the older ones. I was supposed to bring them and show and compare both. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so these are the new ones. Uh, cool Gray to me looks really good. Um, just the look of the gray tones and the different material and stuff like that uh, a lot of people was waiting on these a lot of people are super excited about these um i just did the uh raffle on sneakers and the draw and i won so uh, if i wouldn't have won i don't think i would have pursued these or went after them but i just so happened to win got them for retail so i said you know why not but uh they definitely look good so I don't know, um, is it more exclusive having these, the new ones or the older ones? Like now I'm torn, like should I just start rocking my new ones and keep my old ones like looking nice or should I just rock my old ones, wear them out and then start rocking these? Uh, let me know in the comments what you think I should do or which ones you think look better. Uh, my old ones still look fairly good. Of course, if you remember the box for the old one, uh, it was definitely more detailed, put together. Um, so yeah. That is the Cool Gray Jordan 11s. I also finally have a pair. Let me get the Unions. Jordan Unions. Uh, these are the Jordan 4s. I actually got these from eBay. Uh, Top Star program, program that I love. Ooh, I like, uh, you know, I like kind of the whole paper thing and stuff. So uh, let's see if we can kind of get this in there, opening it up. Okay. And this is the pair that I have, the purple and gold. Um, so I'm just checking it out, man. So it says Union on here on the little, uh, the little Jordan hang tag. Uh, of course, authenticated by eBay. Um, so yeah, this is the big thing about the tongue. I always wanted to see the tongue, what the tongue looks like um, with the stitching and stuff like that. You can actually see the stitching in the back, like a good bit of it, uh, kind of dangling and hanging around um but yeah first pair of union jordans um like i say it was uh, between this and the jordan one a my marie i keep saying that wrong i don't know i might be saying it right i don't know how to find someone pronouncing it and make sure i'm saying it right or wrong but this is it got me a pair of union jordan fours i'm not really a huge jordan four fan as others but uh for getting them for retail i definitely wanted it uh, and I'm actually like the purple. I like the Nike Air in the back in purple. So uh, yeah, I got a lot of purple and gold. These to me are a nice look with the gray, the little blue. Uh, it's a good looking shoe to me. I like the colors and how they put it together. So I will be uh, rocking these bad boys uh, pretty off. Oh, ooh, they got the extra laces. Always big on the extra laces, right? I like these blue laces. These blue laces will probably be the ones that I'm gonna go with. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, and last but not least, of course, first and foremost, the detail in the box. I'm all over the place. <laughs> you can definitely tell the difference in the box of the older pair and the newer pair. Uh, this one has more of a glossier box, so I thought that was dope. Um, so, if you know, you know. Oh, here we go. Jordan 1, patent leather. These look real good. Uh, I really like the patent leather look. Um, I have another pair of patent leather Jordans. Uh, so those with the extra red laces. This one has the actual uh, little Jordan dangly jump man. But uh, definitely shout out to the plug for being able to get me these. Um, it's actually a couple of people that had to uh, work together to make it happen. And of course I do have my old pair right here. I'm gonna pull them out. Um, I messed them up. Uh, I went somewhere and it has a lot of glitter and the glitter has like stuck on my shoe. I tried to clean them off like many different ways and I cannot uh, get them clean. So yeah, so here we are looking at, uh, you can obviously from the light, you can see a lot of the glare, um, but yeah, 
This is it. These are the leather braids. This is the all patent leather, and it's really just everything's patent leather. Um, you know, so it just depends on I guess what you like and what you're more accustomed to. Uh, definitely blessed and happy to be able to have both. But uh, that covers my latest sneaker pickups, um, all Jordans. But you know, <laughs> it is what it is. Uh, hopefully y'all love being blessed and having a good one, man. That's all I got for you, man. Just a little quick drop in on my latest pickups. Uh, got a few shoes on my list that I'm working to get. Um, but again, like I said in the beginning of the video, I'm trying to do other things first and I'm already thinking about buying something. I might buy something this weekend. I'm gonna just keep it real. At the time of this video, uh, I might have picked up something already. Um, but I haven't picked up anything yet as we're filming. But uh, we're gonna see, man. I got a little itch to get some sneakers. <laughs> but that's it, man. That's all I got for you, man. It's your boy, True. Peace.